Hi, my name is Yebe, and today I'm going to share with you the standard that I've chosen for visual arts. Um, so the anchor standard that I've chosen is from the presenting category, and it says select, analyze, and interpret artistic work for presentation. So this comes from um, the framework matrix for the National Core Art Standards. And there are four criteria for the artistic processes, creating, presenting, responding, and connecting. And there are three common anchor standards for each of the criteria. So the one that I've chosen goes for the presenting criteria. And it's one of the first, it's the first one out of the third, three standards. Um, the standard is Oh, it comes from the National Core Art Standards. And I chose this because I will be teaching visual arts in the classroom. And the grade level I will be speaking to you about is seventh grade. And The standard I will be going through is this one over here for the seventh grade. Um, compare and contrast how technologies have changed the way artwork is preserved, presented, and experienced. The skills that the students will need is they will need to select a technology or select an artist artwork and be able to analyze how the technology affects the artist or the artwork in the artwork process and be able to interpret on their own why this is significant in the presentation of art. So the two activities that I have come up with for the standard is how, uh, how does technology affect the way we view art? And choose one of the technologies and present and specify with art and artist examples. So this question is going to be a group activity um, resulting in a group presentation. So each group will be having different technologies and different artwork to present. And the second activity question is, how does technology change the way artists produce art? And this will be resulting in a research paper, which includes research on the technology and how it affects certain artists and their art. And they will also need to specify um, the specific artists and the artwork as well. So, and they will also need to include their interpretations. And the way I will be assessing these two activities will be mainly based on a rubric that I've created based on the core standard or anchor standard for myself and the students. Thank you.